Hello everyone. Hope you all doing well and welcome back to our Windows Server 2022 beginners video series on MSFT webcast. In this video, we will see the steps on how to reset the Active Directory DSRM password. Directory Services Restore Mode is a boot mode on a domain controller for repairing and restoring Active Directory data. An administrator can use DSRM to repair or recover an Active Directory database. This password grants database access for emergencies but not to the domain or services. Unlike workstations and servers, domain controllers do not have a local administrator account. This means you cannot log on to them locally. If Active Directory fails on a domain controller, you may be unable to log on with your domain credentials. This could prevent you from repairing Active Directory. DSRM allows you even if Active Directory has failed. The DSRM administrator account is the only local user account on a domain controller. This account is not accessible when the DC is booted into normal mode. As its name implies, the account can only be used when the DC is booted into Directory Services Restored Board. Login anti.backslash-administrator as the username. The DSRM password allows you to log in locally without having access to any domain. To boot your computer into DSRM mode, you need to know the DSRM administrator password, which is set during the process of promoting member server to a domain controller. There is a chance you could forget the DSRM administrator password because it's so rarely used. I have seen a number of Active Directory environments where the DSRM password for the domain controllers is not known or safely stored for future use. If you forget your DSRM password or you want to reset it, you can update it with the command line tool and DSUtil. Log on to the domain controller using an account with administrative rights. Right click on Start menu and select Windows PowerShell Admin. At PowerShell, type command NTDS util and press Enter key. Type set DSRM password, hit Enter to execute the command. At the DSRM command prompt, you can reset the password for either the server on which you are working or for another remote server. To reset the DSRM password of local domain controller, type reset password on server null and enter the new password when prompted. In this example, I'm logged in to the domain controller, so I'll be using the reset password on server null command to reset local domain controller's DSRM password. The null variable assumes that the DSRM password is being reset on the local computer. Press enter key. Type the new DSRM password. No character will appear when you type the password. Enter the password for DSRM administrator account second time for confirmation. Hit enter key again. Password has been set successfully confirms the DSRM administrator password has been reset successfully. To reset the password for another server, type reset password on server server name, where server name for the server on which you are resetting the DSRM password. Type reset password on server ws2022-dc02.msftwebcast.com and hit enter key. Now enter the new password. Retype the password for confirmation. Hit enter again to change the DSRM password on ws2022-dc02 domain controller. Add DSRM password prompt Type Q to exit. At the NTDS util command prompt, type Q to exit the utility and return to Windows PowerShell. There are chances that you could forget your DSRM administrator password because it's so rarely used. So it is recommended to write it down this password somewhere and store in secure place. In this video, you learn how to reset or update the Active Directory DSRM administrator account to password. That's all for this video. I hope you found this video helpful. 
If you have any questions and suggestions regarding this video, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.